Hello, uh, how are you today? Uh, this is Bong Su Jung, Korean labor attorney. Today, I'd like to introduce uh, one dismissed case related to British, British golf coach who once worked in Korea. So, in this uh, dismissal case, uh, there are some main points uh, related to the whether British uh, golf coach can be an employee or freelance, or how to discipline the how to dismiss uh, the employee whether it uh, like uh, justification of discipline action also last one is uh, how to make um, a settlement agreement so what item should be considered very carefully those three items is important for this dismissal case so this uh, um, British golf coach um, got a job at big uh, the sports company in Korea and he successfully worked for two years and uh, he c then company was satisfied with uh, his performance so uh, both parties renewed the contract uh, with the same working condition so uh, then British golf coach thought it would be very good to settle down in Korea so he invited his uh, uh, the girlfriend, also they got married uh, recently, so they uh, started uh, their living together in Seoul. So his, he worked uh, same way like he worked three days in Seoul, uh, in indoor golf, um, the, uh, field, I mean indoor golf uh, practice field, and three days in Oak uh, Valley located in Wonju. So she thought uh, three days of work uh, in Seoul and three days work in Wonju is okay. So, but uh, after six months uh, for renewed country, uh, company suggests that you should work um, in the Oak Valley in Wonju for six days uh, st straightly. Uh, so, um, uh, if you could not accept this one, um, we cannot hire you anymore. So, then the employee was uh, could not accept it because uh, uh, he may uh, be separated with uh, his newly uh, uh, married wife. So uh, she thought it was not possible. Then company um, uh, gave him the last uh, um, the command. If you could not accept, uh, we'll hire you as a part time like. Uh, your working hours will be, will be reduced half, but uh, employee didn't accept. So then um, company uh, the verbally informed uh, your country will be terminated at the end of uh, this month, uh, something. So uh, then um, employee, like golf coach, visited my uh, this label law firm and asked for uh, legal representation. So I represented uh, this golf coach as a labor attorney and um, we claimed uh, his employee, so he's uh, entitled to protection on the Korean Labor Standard Act. So in the disciplinary process, uh, company must give him little notice for termination. So, but company uh, didn't do that, so it would be uh, unfair termination. So, uh, the Labor Commission judges, uh, they thought, uh, they agreed with me. So, uh, the judges suggest some settlement with uh, this uh, golf coach. Then, um, we suggest uh, some settlement money, including severance pay and this compensation for uh, illegal termination. But the company was uh, shocked to hear uh, the golf coach is freelance or contract, not the employee. But I uh, explained to them uh, the golf coach is employee. Uh, because uh, he exclusively worked for the employer, uh, also fixed the salary, uh, also he has assigned the working hours, uh, working uh, place. So uh, that means uh, it, it's an uh, employee, not the contractor or freelancer. So um, uh, judges in the Labor Commission supported my uh, opinion. So company had to accept the, uh, the amount of severance pay. Also, they accepted a certain amount of money for this settlement. 
So in this settlement agreement, we are very confused with uh, some uh, uh, wording, something like uh, uh, both parties agreed on the settlement fee, certain amount of money, but its uh, payment is very important. So I stipulate that payment, uh, uh, this amount of money should be paid regardless of tax. Tax uh, will be uh, it's a company's uh, burden, they must take care of that. So I stipulate that. So this is a very good uh, way to avoid uh, any uh, the, uh, potential the, uh, the risk uh, coming from misunderstanding of uh, about tax issue. So this is the how we handled the, the case uh, peacefully. So please remember three part I remember whether employee or not or the, the justification of this action and how to make a settlement agreement properly. Okay, thank you for watching. Bye bye.